Hello everyone, my name is Fleet and welcome back to Mind Scanners. Now, it's been a while since I've played this, uh, probably not showing on the channel, but it's been a while since I've played this. So I don't quite remember what I left off at. I think we helped a couple of people. I try to keep personalities intact, but um, this game is hard. It's really freaking hard. So let's just go ahead and jump back into it. Oh, hi again, doctor. Sorry, I, I left you in a hurry yesterday. It's kind of nice being old Becky again. I still want to fight for cyborg rights, but in a more peaceful way. <laughs> Thank you for letting me cool down. Hey, no problem, Christine. Okay, so we have two people I've never met before, so we're just gonna... I'm gonna grab one. I don't have money, looks like, which is no big surprise, really. Um, very quickly, I'm gonna just double, triple check my um, devices. Oh, no. All right, it's fine. Let's just go ahead. You're 60, you're 55. Let's go to the guy, because he's just... Look, I, if I could say five seconds, let's go ahead. Della Crox lives in the penthouse apartment. After taking the elevator to the top floor, you knock on his door. You wait a while. Do I want to break down the door or do I want to knock again? Let's knock again. Let's be polite. You knock once more and listen carefully. You hear someone inside. Oh, I'm wasting my time. Oh, no. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. Please open. No. Please go away. You're not real. Oh, I see. I see. We have... Well. All right. My, well, I'm a mind scanner. Do you mind opening up? A mind scanner? P prove it. Write your ID number on this piece of paper. I mean, okay. Wasn't aware I, I had one. He slides a small piece of paper under the door. You write your ID and pass it through again. After a while, he unlocks the door. All right. You believe me now? You, you're real? I'm terribly sorry. I, I'm not used to visitors. You must excuse me. I, I'm trembling. Get to work. No, I'm gonna cover him. You seem like a nice guy. It's okay, buddy. We're humans. As his eyes catch yours, he pauses. You feel a burning passion behind the eyes of this tormented man. He looks away, and you help him get to his feet. Well, let's get you back up and running, man. So, tell me, why are you here, Scanner? Heard of my ghost stories? I will participate in a mind scan if you promise to be careful. I am a fragile soul. Oh, I will treat it with care and respect, I promise. Let's go ahead. Ugh, the goat crone. My mom told me this fairy tale when I was a child. She is a ghost that haunts me, that haunts and eats children who misbehave. Please, she's terrifying. Next image. His mother ate children. Loves ghost stories. Bad influence. I would say he loves ghost stories. No, he probably doesn't love ghost stories. Or maybe he does. Let's see. Yeah, it's a bad influence. Okay. This is the fine dress I made for Fiona Starr, the ballet dancer. After her death, it was returned to me. But that same night, it it crawled onto my bed, so I burned it. He he is haunted. A bag of groceries. I get my assistant to shop for me nowadays. Last time I brought groceries, I saw cans of corn and apple juice flying around. I ran away screaming and knocked over stacks of honey. Embarrassing. Embarrassed by hallucinations. Throw stuff around. You're embarrassed by your hallucinations. My mother's embarrassing. She died when I was in my teens. That was the first time I saw one of them. A ghost. They disappeared again and didn't return until a year ago. I have no clue why. I would say traumatic loss. Delacroix suffers from hallucinations, or ghosts as he calls them. Though he is quite aware that these ghosts are not real, they continue to haunt him, terrorizing his life and work. Well, let's let's help you out then. Let's remove those ghosts. The designer, a waiting treatment. So he only has eight, which is not bad. Some patients' minds are more complex than others. Keep an eye out for any instabilities like trauma bones, electro 
elect triggers and in case brain freezes. Okay. I knew this much, but I am nervous about the treatment. I hope it doesn't trigger any apparitions. Uh, it, it shouldn't. It shouldn't. Kind of worried about what this robot was talking about, but let's switch stuff out. Do I need... I do need this one. How much is this going to cost me? It's 50 time. I'm not going to cure him in time. But I also need this. I'm going to take a chance. I mean, worst case scenario, um, I suck at this and then we come back, okay? And you guys won't even see it. So I'm just going to develop this. Um, moves up to three in a row of an insanity type. Organic mirrors the souls through their eyes. Watch the pattern extract it. Okay, this is going to be creepy. I could already feel it. All right, so now that we have this, I need to swap this out with something else. And also, a huge thank you to the comments for uh, pointing out the bug. I noticed it in editing, but obviously, I fell victim to it. So I greatly appreciate it, guys. I do read every single one. So let me go ahead. It looks like this one... Is it? No, it's this one, and then this one. Yeah, we'll be fine. I'm just gonna move those over a bit because I want it in a straight line and I think we're okay. This is for the personality. I'm gonna drag this over just in case. Alright, let's just go ahead and see how much I can do for 75 seconds. It's probably not a lot, but oh no. I don't like this. Well, I don't like it either, but it's fine. We just started. Um, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, five. Oh, I see. It stays frozen during that time period. Okay. Um, we can do this again. One, two, three, four, five. Fifty seconds. Let's switch to this. Oh, it's no, it's that simple. Oh, crud. Okay, wait. And then from here, it's these two. All right, great. And then we can switch to this device. Slow and steady. I don't want to hurt him. Alright, perfect. One, two, three. Fuck. Wrong device. Is it the wrong- Oh my god, it is the wrong device. No, please! I needed the money! <laughs> Wait, I think I could have did this if I actually, like... Ah, uh, I have regrets! End of the day, I can't pay. Yes, 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 yes. For m normality and the mind. Game over. Okay, we're gonna pretend that didn't happen. We can do this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the same exact steps, guys. And I will meet you when we start this with him again. Um, okay, so upon us jumping back, I was quickly clicking along and basically, long story short, I accidentally selected the wrong decision um, compared to what we first did. I actually kicked down his door instead of comforting him. So I'm going to slow this down so you guys can see it since I was quickly clicking. But as you can see, we got a different result. Anyway, back to the game. Okay, now that we are back to where we left off, I'm going to get that machine. All right, let's get this one because we're going to need it. I need this one as well. Did the symbols change? Oh, the symbols changed. Okay, so I need this one. I didn't have to spend for this one then. Oh my gosh. Well, now I just feel dumb. <laughs> but it's okay. This is something I needed anyway, so we're, we're going to keep this. So we have this, that, and this one. Okay. We look like we should be good to go with only 80 seconds, so that's that's lovely. Okay, so I'm gonna go with this one. I wanna take this slow, because I know with these things, if you try to rush it, his voice cracks, and I've seen damage occur, so I don't wanna stress him out. All 
All right, perfect. You want to switch to this one then? What am I looking for? One, two, two. Running out of time, so I need to hurry up. It should be okay with the time given. I was rushing it. There we go. Alright, we did it! Okay, perfect! Eight seconds. Whew. Treatment complete. Plus 15. Yes, money! I think I feel... I don't know exactly. Perhaps a little less anxious? I really hope this worked, Doctor. We'll see. I'll call you tomorrow, alright? I'll try to get some rest before I continue on with my suits. Okay. Glad to be of assistance, sir. She's 10 away, but that's going to be the end of the day. Um, but we can at least get an idea of what this is about. So, Safi Sparkles, familiar face can be seen on ads and products all over the structure. Despite her success, a bitterness seems to grow inside her. Her behavior may influence our citizens, so it's time to act. So I'm going to end the day. It's not letting me travel to her. End of day 21. Maintenance, minus 7. Alright, perfect. I have 10. We're getting there, guys. I'm becoming rich. Oh. Console, write, testing, testing. Game data manager, instance, add. Why would you put minus 10? You... I... Why? I... I literally just was- I was complimenting myself on being rich and you took it away from me. The family of Derek Browning is getting more and more concerned about the magician called Pitu? Pip- Pitu? Pip- Pitu. Pip- Pitu. A fictionist character performed by Derek himself. Oh, good golly. Let's go to her. I have a feeling I'm going to dismiss her. If I worked with the Moon Rise people, odds are this is something that I would have needed to clear. Oh, a mind scanner? Ah, uh, I get it. I finally woke up and began criticizing our government. And all of a sudden, you show up. <laughs> Incredible. Well, okay. Let's rid my mind of my destructive thoughts. Okay, you sound wildly... conscious. The Gates. My dad was a small, current engineer there when I was growing up. He showed me some holes in the wall where I could peek out to the outer zone. Why is it kept from us? Dad did a bad job. Questions the rules, peeping Tom. I think you questioned the rules, you little rebel. Ugh, my old boss, Mr. Dirkman. I quit the job before sexual harassment charges. That smile needs a good punch, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> Knock those teeth right out. Uh, she's definitely a boxer. No, I think the answer is revenge. It's the Kapok scanner in my foyer. I don't get this. We pay maintenance every day. But where do these billions of Kapok go? The streets are overrun with trash. It makes you think. Trash makes brain work. Doesn't get computers, questions the system. You definitely question the system. Miss Sparkle has developed the fantastical notion that the structure is not acting in her best interest. She is clearly against the system. This anti-structure behavior is a danger to our society. I don't really... I, like, I know I already screwed up the side ending for Moonrise, because I'm guessing this would probably go with the um those people, but... I, I can't, in good heart, say she's insane, so I'm sorry. I'm probably gonna get in trouble for this. Yeah, I, I don't see it. She's perfectly fine. Patient declared sane. No further actions required. Plus three. I guess you're alright, Scanner. Sorry if I seemed angry before. I just feel that our society is going in the wrong direction. Like, we should do something. I see you are doing your part. Sorry I distrusted you. That's okay. Game dad. Oh my god. Instance. <gasps> fine object type player. The type of name space player could not be fine. Found. Destroy game object fine. Wait, no. Please don't. Please do not do this 
Wait, oh, you're deleting her. She's deleting herself. Wait, wait. Argument exception. Value does not fall within the expected range. Movements. I can't see this. What? So she gave me money, but she tried to delete herself from what it looks like. Alright, so, um, there's only one location to go, so I guess we'll go there and we'll pretend like we didn't see, uh, Beatrice try to destroy the entire system. She could wait while I'm out of the game. Salutations. It is I. Pip to- uh, I can't figure out his name. Pitu? Pipitu. Magician, reader of disguise, truth seeker, advisor to kings. Pray tell me, who are you? I am a mind scanner. Of course. Pipitu already knows this. Just testing you. Pipitu knows everything. Aha. Uh -huh. let's, let's do a scan. Two images at once. How strange. I'm holding a toolbox full of scanners and screws. And then... A banquet hall. I sit next to the Duke. Seeing double split personality lunch break. I would say that's a split personality. One of the ghosts that haunts the outer zone. The walls will keep it out. Oh. Okay. Shielding, bricklayering, easily scared. I would say bricklayering. Guess not. The portal, I thought that I'd never see it again. A portal into the derrick. No time to bid my loved ones farewell. A dragon. At the throat, you'll find the rare Carpus gem that has eluded fortune seekers for eons. This is his world. Silken finery, adorned with the planets and stars, embroidered in purest gold, magnificent nightgown. Pipitsu likes luxury. Derek Brownie believes himself to be possessed by the spirit of an old court magician. If true, his family issues are the least of his problems. Yeah, we're gonna... Buddy, you're not okay. And we're gonna try to make you okay. 19. Okay, we have 19. The Reflector. Awaiting treatment. Pipitu? Insane? Don't make me laugh. Methinks the world has gone insane. Not I. Your machines will solve nothing, Skull Washer. Okay. I do like the insult of Skull Washer. That sounds... I don't know. Interesting at the very least. Um. Alright, I need this machine. I need this one. Boom, boom, and I need this one. I think that is all the ones that I need to have in my immediate vicinity. And we can begin. I don't think I'm going to finish this in time, but thank you, Beatrice, for giving me monies. So, what do we have? I don't know why it's blinking. It's alarming me. Um, we're going to get rid of this one. Negative thoughts. Oh, yeah, that is negative. Is it like a bomb? It's making me think of a bomb. I'm gonna try to get rid of it. I just looked away for the last one. It is a bomb. Okay, that's freaking terrifying. Why? Why would that? Why would? Why? Okay, I'm sorry. I'm not paying attention. Alright, let's get rid of this first one. My tip with this one is that if you're moving this and you hear it cracking, just slow it down. Because I notice like the shaking is an indication that it's going too fast. Alright. And what do we have after that? Another bomb. Okay, okay. Fudge the goals. I'll just... Should I just get rid of it? Yeah, it's probably the best one because it takes the most time. 
I have time, I have time. Don't listen to the beeping. All is well. Okay. Oof. Terrifying. Okay. Um. Let's just do it in small bursts. Agony. Yep, that's bad. What do we have after that? Oh, fudge the goals. Um. Empty. Get rid of that. Okay, get rid of this. Woo! I couldn't even commentate because I was too busy. Oh my god, there's another one. It's that bottom one again. Get rid of that. Actually, what we... Oh, his personality! I fucked up. Oh, no. I'm sticking to my decisions. I know I can rewind, but I'm sticking to my terrible decisions. This is Greg Roberts, owner of Zegtronics. Our most prized employee, Miss Mertens, has disappeared. She was last seen in your care. This is an immense loss for our company. You will have to pay. Miss Mertens? <laughs> this is not good. Zegtronics has asked for compensation for the disappearance of... Be oh, Beatrix Mertens. You your form I I I I did not do such things Today's news it seems like the outer zoners are building small settlements outside our city walls wall officials describe the situation as strange It does look like a small town says one of the officials. There are now around 8,000 outer zoners in these settlements. I, I, I messed that up. Royal, oh my god. Do I rewind? Do I, no, I don't. Nope. We have to stick. We already, we already screwed this up anyway. So we might as well just continue. <laughs> Pipitu, am I? Okay. All right, Yoda. All right, we already got a ticking time bomb. That's lovely. I love being stressed first thing in the freaking day. I'm on slow and steady winds of rice. We don't hear the beeping. We definitely do not hear the beeping. We don't hear a single beep. See, get out of here, hater. Well, since we're here, we might as well continue and get this last one out. At least we'll get the plus 15 the poke. But I definitely did destroy his personality, unfortunately. I definitely want to play this game again and see if I can get the different endings. Alright, this one should be easy. Phobia. Get rid of that. And we're good to go. I ruined your personality, though. So the only personality that was showing was the split one. <laughs> Derek wants to be himself. Derek? Derek? Yeah, Derek ain't home, is he? I... Guys, I really screwed that one up. And she is 65. Okay. Bert is a simple-minded factory worker. No one has ever complained about him. He's generally seen as a nice guy. Lately, his employer at the Flesh Factory has been worried about his vivid imagination. Let's see. Bert, Her Bert Herbert has visitor. Bert Herbert says hi. Visitor must be quiet. Shh. Little man is sleeping. Little man. Little man is very little. Little man sleeps in the left armpit of Bert Herbert. Oh, I see. 
All right, mind scan it is. Pumpkin pie, lovely. Bert Herbert loves it. And so does Little Man. Little Man eats too much pumpkin pie. Little Man vomits into the belly button of Bert Herbert. It doesn't matter. Bert Herbert wipes it off. Um, projects himself? Infant? I would say he projects himself. Flesh Factory. Bert Herbert works there. Poor animals. People eat them. Bert Herbert is sad for creatures. Bert Herbert and Little Man only eat vegetables. Um, it's not the perfect job and he's not a carnivore, so miss mismatch? Little Man? Little Man, Bert Herbert loves Little Man. Bert Herbert takes Little Man out of pocket, watching the trees and bushes, throwing rocks in Red Lake. Bert Herbert has fun times with Little Man. Uh, I would say definitely genitals are good company. <laughs> no! <laughs> I would say you, you got yourself quite a friend. Bert is not using the full potential of his brain. This has led to a lonely life as a factory worker. His shy spirit has created an invisible friend. A friend that keeps him company. A friend he cares for. But... A false friend. I see. So, if I free him, I remove his friend. I mean, technically, he's living a harmless life. I don't know. This is tricky. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with the insane and see how this plays out, so I know in the future. Twenty-one types. Jeez. We only have 75 seconds. This is impossible. Bert Herbert is sick? I understand. It's a right, little man. Dr. Scanner will fix me. Oh no, I regret this. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I'm gonna take your friend away. I... <sighs> Buddy, you're not... You're not... You know, you're not doing so well mentally. You know, and... It's... It's... It's something we gotta treat. Alright, we'll get rid of this one. Oh, I haven't used this in a while. There goes the wiggles. There goes the wiggles. Look for all the speedy wiggles. There it goes. And while all those are defrosting, I can just do this one. Motivation? It looks like it's gonna be... That's a good one. Misery. Let's get rid of that. Okay, so we can probably do this one. While those things are deep thawing. And that's Wiggles. I need someone to yell at me during this sequence to be like... Personalities. Keep an eye out on the personalities. I'm waiting for them to dethaw, and then I can get three of them. There we go. Um, alright, screwed myself, it looks like. Oh no, I ran out of time. Time's up. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm gonna <sighs> I'm gonna end up ruining his happiness, aren't I? Minus seven. You keep waking up, but is this a dream? I'm scared. Incoming message from the structure. Oh no. The officials by the name of Jimmy Wastox is a suspected robot robosexual. A robosexual Oh my god. The officials by the name of it, Jimmy Wastox, is a suspected robosexual. As robosexuality is forbidden in the structure, we cannot have him controlling our streets. Firing him could start riots, so we need you to correct him. Treating him will not be enough. You need to erase his personality. Don't worry. 
will pay extra for your trouble. For normality and the mind. I... This is Moonrise. Has the structure allowed you to see your daughter yet? No. I don't know if this is Moonrise. I feel like this wouldn't be something. Is this a test? Am I being tested? I'm gonna I'm gonna answer honestly. No. We thought as much. Do not trust them. Do not help them. Think about your daughter. Do not break the people. Break the structure. I am back, buddy. I have to pay attention to your needs, because clearly I'm an offender here. Thank you for giving me a clear one this time. Alright. What do we want to do? We want to get rid of this middle one. What is that? Hopelessness? No, that's bad. You have a future. A lonely one, because you're not going to have your friend, but you're, you, you still have a future. I have to get the hang of this game. Um, agony. That is a bad one. Is that one I, sh I should wait for this? He looks so sad. Oh my gosh. That, that is two. Two personalities left. Alright, that's perfect. That was it. Um, we don't have to worry about a defrosting. Personality boost next. Okay, what we got here? Um, it looks like this one. And I'll do one more because I know I'm going to get carried away again. That looks like a long one. Maybe this one? Oh, fudge. No, keep searching. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. I gotta remember that they can show me false ones, too. Alright. Actually, let's go with this one. We are obviously are not gonna cure him on the first one, but I just didn't want to remove his personality. Alright, switch to this one. Passion, that's good. Passion is good. Uh, passion again. Okay. Empty. Let's get rid of that. And then we only have this one left. Alright, perfect. Keep scrolling. Let's try to get this as quick as... This is not wiggling as much. There we go. Alright, last one. Nice! And your personality's intact. I, I'm really sorry for ripping your friend, though. I... I'm Bert Halbert, yes, but I... I'm alone? Little man does not exist? He was just my imagination. Oh. That's... No. I'm never gonna see him again? Oh, little man. I miss you. Ah, I regret this. Oh, I regret that so much. I... I'm so freaking sorry. Oh, I'm sad. I broke him. I, I broke the friendship that I had with him. Hello, doctor. This is Wilma Brown. Thank you so much for removing that lord awful pipcoot person, but my Derek is not quite himself yet. I hope this will pass. I miss him so much, you know. I know, I ruined that too. Today's news. A suspicious group of people were spotted scaling the restricted areas of the wall near the northern gates. Officials in the northwest part of the Splendors state that the suspects were up to something and asked all citizens to keep an eye out for anyone suspicious in that area. In 
other news, the Outer Zoners continue to grow in numbers outside our gates. The newest estimate is approaching 12,000. Guys are really fucked up. I should have just left him and Little Man alone. I just, I, it was so obvious. No, go away. This ain't right. I'm an official. I did nothing wrong. I was just inspecting those robots. I... This is a mistake. Oh. Um. It's that cyborg activist. What's her name? Christine. That's it. She's cool and all. But, uh... Not my type. Don't get me wrong. Rights for cyborgs. It's just... Mixing robotics with flesh is not really my thing. Prefers 100% robots. Prefers 100% humans. Cybersexual. He prefers 100% robots. My partner. Um, you know. My robo-partner at the COC. Um, excuse me. My partner. Um, you know. My robo-partner at the SOC. I don't have a wife or anything. Um, but yeah. My partner's great. We got each other's backs. He has saved my life more than once, so yeah. He's great. Cares for partner, loves his wife, likes to work alone. He cares for his partner. Maybe a little too much. The fabulous entrance of Le Circuit. My favorite restaurant in the structure. The waiters move between tables in such a perfectly timed rhythm. And they care for me. And for everyone else, of course. Uh, Robo Waiters. Jimmy has been hiding his sexuality from the public. Instead of suppressing his robo-sexuality, he's been visiting sex box in secrecy. This information has been unknown to SOC until now. Oh my gosh, do I... I mean... Is it consensual? Is that... Is that something that... Like, I can cure him. But... He's clearly sane. He just... He just likes robots. Listen, man, I'm not gonna kink shame. I don't, I'm not one to kink shame, so I'm gonna say you're sane. I'm sorry. He's, he's, he's just... He's... <laughs> I'm sorry, I just can't. I can't, I can't. That's kink shaming. Patient declared sane. No further action required. Plus three. I'm happy we got that sorted out. Um, please excuse me. I have some orders to carry out. Warn him, don't warn him. I'm gonna warn you. What? Oh, oh no, I must. Thank you. I know a place to hide. I, I have to keep low. I'll manage. I'll have someone who can help me. Thank you for warning me. Thank you so much. Yeah, man, it's okay. If you're just into that, you know. Oh, no. You did not erase Jimmy's personality? How disappointing. We'll have to deal with this ourselves, then. Okay. As long as you leave me out of it, I, I don't care. You can do whatever you want, but I am not one to kink shame. Ursula Boulevard is known for her cutthroat methods and impressive command of words. She can convince anyone of anything. But clients have found her oddly quiet lately. Let's see. We could probably do a mind scan on her and then maybe begin treatment, but not so much. I see. A mind scanner. Before we start this procedure, I will have to inform you that your instruments will not be applicable in my case. May I ask why? Well, the voice I am speaking to you in right now is not my own. It hasn't been for some time. Therefore, any response I provide to your testing will not be my own. Alright, I'll take note of that. My insides. To be frank, they do not look like mine. These are enthralls, the tongue, and blood vessels of someone else. It seems like you're having some identity problems here. A jury. Following my every move. My words confuse them, but they'll believe whatever this mouth wants them to believe. 
So sounds like you're manipulative. Oh. The old lady in the witness stand. Liar, she called me. Over and over. My mouth was in control, not I. Excuse for lying. Boulevard believes the words coming out of her mouth are no longer her own. Scared to use them, she has silenced herself at work and is unable to function in society. Yeah, girl, we're gonna have to treat you. That don't sound right. 21, and we're gonna need those devices. Alright. Insanity is a much too simple word. But you work with that. But you work with what you've got, I suppose. Alright. Don't be rude to me. I'm just trying to treat you, lady. Alright, we need this one. We need the one I just removed. And we need this. I like to keep them on the, the right hand side, so don't judge me. Um, but I think we are good to at least begin treatment. I don't see us successfully doing, completing it, but you know, we can begin it. Alright, so let's get this one out of the way. Um, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, six. Alright, let's switch this one. Do-do. Alright, perfect. Um, let's do that. And then, oh. Passion is good. Phobia is bad. Let's get rid of that phobia. What do we have after this? Different sequences. That's not good. Let's get rid of this one. What? Up. That one was an odd sequence, sorry. Um, we're gonna go to your personality. Boost that a bit. Oh, this is terrible. Why does this keep happening? It might be that? No, it is not that. Okay. The citizen requires further treatment. I agree. I do believe I'm gonna end it here, though. So let's see if anything happens. End of? Nope. Alright, so I am going to end it here. I did not have much time to play today. But I will continue doing this. Obviously, I'm, I love this series. Uh, but I'm probably going to keep playing to see if I can get multiple endings, you know, so on and so forth. Depending on how the normal ending goes. And assuming that I reach that one. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I will catch you guys in the next one. See ya!